This week, we highlight another life well lived. This summer's record-breaking heat, wildfires, and floods are dramatic reminders that our planet is changing, a concept introduced generations ago in part by one pioneering British scientist. After graduating from college in 1941, James Lovelock worked for two decades at the National Institute for Medical Research in London. In 1957, he invented a groundbreaking portable device called the Electron Capture Detector, which could detect toxic chemicals in food, water, soil, and the atmosphere. It was used in the research for Rachel Carson's Silent Spring, the landmark 1962 book that helped to launch the environmental movement. The device allowed Dr. Lovelock to find that man-made pollutants cause smog, and that chlorofluorocarbons in air conditioning and aerosol cans eat away at the ozone layer, heating the planet. Today, those chlorofluorocarbons are banned in most countries. In 1961, NASA recruited Dr. Lovelock away from the UK. While studying the differences between Earth and Mars, he came up with a theory that has informed climate science in the half-century since. Lovelock's Gaia theory, named for the Greek goddess of Earth, argues our planet is a singular self-sustaining organism, made up of all the water, plants, and animals on its surface. Earth, he argued, regulates its temperature and atmosphere to remain stable and to support life in a way no other planet does. Dr. Lovelock held that the behavior of human beings had begun to throw off that equilibrium. Gaia theory was mocked and dismissed at first before it became adopted widely. The evidence coming in from the world climate change, it's pretty convincing that something nasty is going on. Dr. James Lovelock, whose work laid the foundation for modern climate science, died on Tuesday at home in the southwest of England on his 103rd birthday. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.